More details from police and reaction today on the situation involving alleged threats against Toronto mayoral candidates by a man here in this East York neighborhood, forcing the cancellation of an event last night and also raising questions about how they were informed. Yesterday, the allegations were that it was a firearm. Uh, we don't have that firearm in our possession. So at this time, we can't say whether it was real uh, or what type of uh, firearm it might have been. 29-year-old Francois Lavagues was arrested around 9.30 Thursday night and charged with multiple weapons offenses and uttering threats to shoot those running for mayor, according to police. Police said the arrest was without incident at 42 Division in Scarborough after an afternoon and evening of uncertainty surrounding the candidates. I'm grateful for the police uh, and uh, the threat is not here anymore. Um, and uh, I was concerned um, for my team and, um, and I wasn't personally feeling too threatened. Police said it was allegedly a blanket threat towards mayoral candidates and not directed at anyone in particular and took place during the morning. As a result, a debate scheduled to take place at OCAD University was cancelled for safety reasons. You know, I want to thank the Toronto Police for an amazing job that they did. A quick investigation, making an apprehension and, and moving forward. Now allowing, you know, the, the candidates and more importantly the volunteers uh, an opportunity to feel a little safer as we go forward towards the finish line. We want everyone in our city to be safe. And so it was, you know, definitely um, unfortunate that that happened, but I believe that the, the quick response that happened from Toronto Police to intervene and to apprehend that suspect to remove that threat um, from the campaign entirely uh, was, was really important and, and has happened. Some candidates say they learned about the threat earlier in the afternoon, Others, not until a public news release went out at 3.30 in the afternoon and when an email was then sent out shortly after. I was in contact with them throughout the day on several occasions, making sure that we were, uh, you know, following their advice on every event that we had. But like I said, I will not be intimidated as a candidate and I'll definitely not be intimidated as your mayor. We have been in discussion with our security partners such as uh, cities, um, corporate security. So it is something that evolved and when we felt that uh, we went uh, needed to go public with it, we did it um, all as one uh, to all uh, mayoral candidates at one time. Police said they are aware of an online threat possibly involving the same person. But that is being treated as a separate investigation. Lava Gas was in court at 2 o'clock this afternoon, and further details of the case are now under a publication ban. The matter has been held over until Monday when the police, as the police investigation continues.